There is one organ which causes high blood pressure, and it's not what you think. And there are specific exercises you can use to target and fix your blood pressure easily. No diet, lifestyle changes, or medication required. Check the link in the description below, but for now, today's question. Yes. Remember normal blood pressure is 120-80, higher than 140-90 and the use of blood pressure medicine might be considered. In between these two, lifestyle modifications will be suggested. Not smoking. Moderating alcohol intake. Increasing fruits and vegetables in diet. Limiting salt intake. Reducing stress. Exercise. Weight loss. When measuring one's own blood pressure, try to be consistent about the measurements. Use the same equipment. Same time of day. Same arm. Left versus right same body position. Seated, calmly with feet on ground and back against the chair's back. Record the blood pressure in a log and also any circumstances that may affect the reading. Examples, finished big breakfast, took walk, argued with wife use the record to understand how life choices are affecting you. If blood pressure readings are consistently high, see a doctor. Symptoms may or may not be present. Headache, dizziness, blurred vision, chest pain palpitations, anxiousness, perspiration. The body is not designed to withstand high blood pressure values. The heart will work harder to push blood through stiff and non-compliant blood vessels. In hypertension, the result, like any muscle being worked, is enlargement of the heart. However, unlike biceps, the heart's function will be impaired as it enlarges. Also, high pressures will lead to shear forces tearing the intimal lining, inner, surface of blood vessels. This is the type of damage that triggers strokes, heart attacks and dissecting aortic aneurysms, a dilating then tearing of the main, largest artery. The blood pressure at its worst, is the number apt to do the harm. What is measured at random moments is only a glimpse of how we are when other situations occur. So, when blood pressure is high, even temporarily, it places vulnerable blood vessels at risk of damage. Small vessels in the eye and kidneys getting damaged lead to two of the more common consequences from hypertension, retinopathy and nephropathy. Your question, is a blood pressure of 160-90 high? Is yes. It should be a wake-up alarm to investigating your health. Hypertension is a silent killer. It is one of the leading risk factors, if not the most important risk for cardiovascular disease. Even more than weight, cholesterol and smoking. Blood pressure is categorized as follows, normal, less than 120 80ths of a millimeter, Hg, prehypertension, 120 80 to 139 80 39 80 30 Hg, stage 1 hypertension, 140 90 to 159 99 of a millimeter, Hg, stage 2 hypertension, 160 100 of a millimeter. HG and above had a blood pressure reading of one pressure reading of one pressure reading of one pressure readings between 160 110 and 180 110 usually indicate stagely indicate stagely ind which puts you at high risk for life threatening problems such as heart attack and stroke. In 2017, new hypertension guidelines were published by the AHA/ACC. The new guidelines lower the threshold for diagnosing hypertension. The rationale or logic, is that complications such as strokes and heart attacks occur at lower values. Normal blood pressure is now considered less than 120 80ths of a millimeter. Hg. Elevated blood pressure is systolic, top value, between 120 to 129 and diastolic, less than 80. Higher systolic or diastolic values are considered hypertension. Remember that clinical diagnosis of hypertension should be made by a healthcare professional. I recommend that you discuss the topic with your physician, as hypertension is a major risk factor for strokes and heart attacks. Medical disclaimer, the comment contains general medical information. Do not use the information as medical advice. The information is not a substitute for medical advice. No warranties or representations are given in relation to the medical information. Please consult your physician if you have any questions about any medical matter. For the full article use our app, My VP Blood Pressure Log. Click here to check it out. Hi. A one-off blood pressure reading could be very high because of extreme stress. So-called white coat hypertension can cause systolic blood pressure, the higher reading, to rise as much as 100 mm Hg, although this is extreme. More often, 
white coat hypertension increases systolic blood pressure by 20 to 30 mm to 30 Hg, and diastolic blood pressure, the lower reading, by 10 mm Hg to 20 mm Hg. On retesting after sitting quietly for 10 and quietly for a high reading often comes down. Ambulatory recording, at regular intervals throughout the day and night will show the true readings over the course of 24 hours. If this confirms a persistent reading greater than 160 hundredths of a millimeter, Hg then stage 2 hypertension is diagnosed. You will need at least one and probably two or three medications to control your blood pressure. You can download a blood pressure classification chart here. Eva also listed the evidence for 42 natural remedies for high blood pressure here and explain how to follow a DASH diet for high blood pressure here. Hope that helps. Sarah B. Hi Bruce, you can download a blood pressure classification chart here on which to plot your blood pressure and a blood pressure reading diary chart here on which to record your readings as you make diet and lifestyle changes to help bring it down. These 42 natural remedies for high blood pressure will help you get your blood pressure back under control. Best wishes, Sarah B.